Tom Polytechnic University. The topic of my presentation is the security analysis of algorithm data complex. So, what is algorithm? Algorand is a new generation of a blockchain launched in 2019. It is the first blockchain that provides immediate transaction dynamics and uh, its transaction throughput is uh, comparable to large payment and the uh, financial network. And also there are many excellent examples on the smart stock, uh, the smart contract security analysis. Most of them are for the Acer Ethereum platform, and uh, none of them are for the Algorand platform. Okay, let me first introduce the Algorand smart contract. To be specific, there are two types of uh, smart contracts in Algorand. There are stateful smart contracts and the stateless smart contract. The stateful smart contract represents an application that uh, we set on the blockchain and are remotely called. The picture on the right um, gave an example code of a stateful smart contract. A stateful smart contract is composed of two programs. Then are the approval program and the clear state program. The approval program handles the main logic of the smart contract. In the given example, the entry point of the approval program start at uh, start with a conventional statement in line 30. It is similar to a dispatcher that uses the type of the uncomplete parameter to determine which program branch to execute. <coughs> the state-like smart contracts are also known as smart signature. It is different from faithful smart contract because the state storage as well as the inner transaction are not allowed to be used in the Generally, a smart signature is accompanied by a transaction and uh, its logic is used, is used to determine whether, whether the transaction will be approved. The given example code shows a smart signature, then check the transaction time, transaction state, receiver, and the amount, and some other critical uh, parameters. To facilitate the development of a smart contract based application, Algorand introduced some new features such as different types of transactions and uh, automatic transfers. To support these new features, Algorand provides a new content for executing smart contracts. Unfortunately, these new, these new features in Algorand enlarge the attack surface of a smart contract. Uh, it uh, could be exploited by the hacker to launch uh, some attack. And uh, in this result project, we perform an analysis of algorithm platform and found six generic smart contract vulnerabilities. In the following, I will discuss the most common four types of vulnerability. <coughs> okay, the first two are unchecked transaction space and the unchecked transaction parameter vulnerability. Both of these vulnerabilities are caused by smart signature uh, which do not properly check the transaction parameter. For example, if a smart signature is used as a signature count and uh, does not check the transaction state, then anyone can use this account to send a transaction with large transaction state. And, uh, this transaction will wipe out all of its values. Similarly, if the repeat to parameter is not checked, an adversary can set the repeat to parameter to, to hit one public address, and, uh, and then he will take over this signature account. Next, the unexpected delete and the update vulnerability. The algorithm smart contract can be updated and the owner of the contract can initiate a special type of transaction to upgrade the smart contract. No sense. Uh, 
other mention when the application not pay the transaction and the application delay the transaction and uh, whether the transaction is uh, approved depends on the program logic. If there is a programming error in the uh, contract, it may result in anyone being able to update or delete the smart contract. Uh, the last one is the unchecked transaction receiver vulnerability. In Ethereum, users can transfer money to an application via tolling gates, and all tasks can be completed in one transaction. But uh, Algorand does not support such a feature. To implement, to implement similarly functionality in Algorand, the automated transaction group must be used to bound the payment transaction and the application call transaction together. Um, no thanks, these two transactions have no relation. As a result, the the sender and the receiver can be arbitrary. Uh, and uh, unfortunately, some developers may make some wrong assumptions. They may assume that the receiver of the transaction are all current applications. If a smart contract does not check the transaction receiver of the payment transaction, uh, then an attacker can specify the receiver as himself to break the program logic. Okay, to detect the information vulnerability, <coughs> we developed an automated tool based on symbolic execution. We named the tool Panda, and this finger shows the workflow and architecture of, the, of Panda. Uh, the user interface affects complex parameters as input, including the user bad settings and the application ID to be detected. Given application ID, the blockchain explorer uses the algorithm SDK to read the program batch code and the global state from the blockchain. Then it uh, is assembled by the code into a tier program by using the SDK. After that, it will save the global state into two symbolic array in memory model according to the data type. Next, the section builder takes the tier byte code as input and then has the job label to construct the control flow graph. The memory model contains all the symbolic arrays used by symbolic executor. And uh, the symbolic executor consists of an output handle registry and uh, an executor. Uh, each output is uh, implemented as a Python function. In the analysis plugin, we provide a registry to which all vulnerability detection rules are added in the form of independent detection function. During the symbolic ex execution process, uh, once a physical path is found, the symbolic executor will transverse and for all functions in the registry to perform the vulnerability detection. It is relatively simple to detect and uh, verify the vulnerabilities of a uh, nature. But things get complicated when the validator is included in the smart simulator. Uh, the validator is a uh, Stable smart contract that is specified in the smart simulator. The security check of a transaction parameter in both the smart signature and the validator uh, should to be taken into account. To solve this challenge, we adopt the new technique of better code rewriting to merge the smart signature and the validator into a new smart signature before the control flow graph is constructed. Uh, it can be said that in the first step, the application ID of the validator is identified and uh, its byte code is downloaded from the blockchain. Uh, next, in the second step, the jump labels in the last signature will remain 
to prevent the name conflict with the labeled in validator. After all, all the return instructions in the smart signature were replaced with the BNC instruction that jumped to the entry point of validator. By doing so, when the end of the smart signature is raised, the symbolic executor will jump to the entry point of the application and uh, continue execution. Suddenly, a new smart signature is constructed by directly concatenating the smart signature to the validator. After all steps are complete, the new smart signature is further proceed to construct the control flow graph. Uh, since the algorithm has two different data types, we should uh, adopt some new techniques to deal with the data type related issues. Uh, it is worth noting that we developed a new method named the S for North type bounding to determine the variable data type. To be specific when using data from the blockchain, we set the data type to annual and uh, only the executor uses the data, data later and uh, there is an output can assist in determining the data type. Uh, the data type will be finally determined. The next part is the vulnerability detection rule. Due to the complexity of algorithm smart contract, uh, uh, defining detection rules need to consider many special cases. Uh, because the semantics of the smart contract is uh, very complex. Uh, that is why the detection rules seem so complicated. Uh, due to the time limitation, I'm going to get this part to cover something more interesting. Uh, this finger illustrates the performance of Panda. We set the execution time limit of uh, each smart contract to 15 minutes. It can be said that the uh, it can be said that most smart, smart contracts can complete the detection within the 10 minutes. Uh, uh, the next is the most interesting part. We use the panda to conduct a vulnerability assessment on all smart contracts on the algorithm blockchain. Uh, the three tables show the evaluation results. From the experimental results, uh, it can be said that these vulnerabilities are are prevalent in the algorithm smart contracts. Uh, it also reveals the urgency of identifying and preventing smart vulnerability. Okay, let's get into the case study. Uh, in this case, I gave a simplified code for the smart signature that includes vulnerability for unchecked transaction phase and the, the unchecked transaction parameter vulnerability. This code is uh, vulnerable because the group size is not a fixed value and uh, at least one of the transaction with parameters has not been valid. Okay, in this case, I give an example code of a smart contract that includes both the arbitrary update and the arbitrary deletion vulnerability. The reason for the vulnerabilities in this code it apparently due to a programming error. Uh, to be specific, there is uh, no quite uh, constraint of the incomplete parameter. Uh, during the evaluation process, we found that a large number of smart signatures use uh, an incorrect way to call the validator. As shown in this finger, the logic of this smart contract restricts the validator's application ID but does not restrict the uncomplete parameter. Therefore, an attacker can use the opt-in or player state transaction to back up the validation logic. This is because the validation code in the validator is not executed when process this type of transaction. It is worth mentioning that the Panda tool has reported many smart contracts with such, vul such vulnerability, some, some of which have last four days, and uh, we help the developer to fix the vulnerability and uh, receive a bug bounty. 
Oh, okay. This is the end of my presentation. Thanks for listening. That's amazing. Thanks, Yu. Uh, okay. For example, uh, support an application uh, implements the backlight functionality and uh, it uh, asks the user to use the uh, uh, use the automate transaction group uh, when making a deposit in in order to transfer money while invoking the application. Um, if the application does not check the receiver of the payment transaction, uh, and uh, 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 if an application does not check the receiver of the transaction, an attacker can set the receiver as himself when making a deposit. Uh, after uh, after the blockchain approved the uh, approved the group transaction, the attacker's balance uh, recorded in the bank will increase, but no money is transferred to the bank. And uh, in the last step, the attacker only needs to withdraw the balance uh, in the bank to make a profit. Mm. Thanks for the question.